In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to install Newsletter Plugin in WordPress and use it. First of all, we need to access the dashboard of our blog. In order to do so, we will first have to log in. Once the dashboard opens up, go to Plugins located on the left side of the screen and click on the Add New button. With that done, a new page of Install Plugins will open. There will be an option of searching for plugins. In the search bar, type Newsletter and then click on the Search Plugins button. You will now be displayed with a new page containing various plugins meeting your search criteria. Choose the one that best meets your requirements. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will choose the very first one. Click on the Install Now button to proceed. A confirmation message will pop up. Click on the OK button to proceed further. With that done, a page will open where the plugin package will download and install itself. This way, you don't have to worry about the files or the installation. It will take a few moments for it to be downloaded. Once the download and installation have been completed, you will be displayed a confirmation message, successfully installed the plugin, plugin name and version. In order to activate the plugin, click on the Activate Plugin option. Once the page refreshes, the Recently Installed Plugins tab will appear on the left-hand side of the screen, right below the Settings tab. Hover your mouse over the Recently Installed Plugin and click on Configuration. Now provide the appropriate email address in the required fields in order to properly configure the plugin and then save the changes you just made. In order to send the newsletters, click on Newsletters option available under the Newsletter tab on the left side of the screen. Once the new page loads, click on the New Message button. A new page will open from where you can choose a theme and preview it as well. Once you've selected a theme, click on the Create the Email button. Over here, compose the email and then click on the Send button. Once you're done, you will be asked if you want to start a real delivery. Click on the OK button and you will be informed that the message has been saved and the email has been added to the queue.